All right, so now that we've set a budget, what I want to talk to you about is the free tier. And the free tier is something that is available to you uh, for the first 12 months of a new AWS account and allows you to utilize AWS services without incurring any cost to you. And so it's in your advantage to utilize this free tier um, as you are experimenting and learning cloud. So if you want to learn about all the offerings, what you do is go to Google, type in AWS free tier, and you'll get this page that explains all the sorts of things here. So you can get uh, 750 hours on EC2, RDS, things like that. There are stipulations in terms of what it would be. So here, this is a T2 or T3 micro, micro, uh, micro running Linux, Red Hat, um, or other type of OSs, okay? So there are uh, details and you have to read the fine print. Some services are only available for the first two months, things like that. So it's going to highly vary based on service, but it's worth giving this a read in areas that you are interested in. Now, the thing is, is how do you know that you are still in the free tier or you go outside of it? And that's what I want to talk to you about right now. So I am actually in another AWS account. So notice in the top right corner, it says brown.lap or hyphen laptop at exampro.co. Sometimes I will switch into different AWS accounts during these follow alongs so I can best show you, um, you know, the settings. So if you make your way over to billing, and actually I should show you uh, up here, if we go to my dealing bash dashboard, just trying to be consistent here, and you go to the left-hand side to billing preferences, what you can do is enable receive free tier usage alerts and then put your email in there and save that. And so turn on this feature to receive email alerts uh, when your AWS uh, service usage is approaching or exceeded the AWS free tier usage limits if you wish to receive these alerts, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, right? And while you're there, I want you to also checkbox receive billing alerts so I can show you how to set a billing, uh, a billing alert and AWS says, you know, budgets are a new thing, but billing alerts are still something that we use as of today. So if you checkbox that on, we'll be able to see your cost. If we go back here, uh, it should show you, um, and it's because I'm out of the free tier on this account, but it would show you in the alerts, you know, your usage there. So an example here is if we scroll down, this is in the documentation tracking your AWS free tier usage you would see like a box like this and would say, hey, your free tier usage limit is here and you're over it, okay? So that generally would show up on this panel here, but again, I'm outside of the free tier, so I'm not seeing it here um, today, okay? So, you know, hopefully that is clear, um, but yeah, there you go.